New developments tonight. When James Holmes appears in court next Monday, he's offering to plead guilty in exchange for a life sentence in prison. 7 News reporter Marshall Zellinger live at the Arapahoe County Courthouse. Marshall, Holmes wants to avoid the death penalty. Mike, that's what's spelled out here in this court filing from today. James Holmes hoping the district attorney here in Arapahoe County will not seek the death penalty on Monday. Instead, Holmes is willing to plead guilty in exchange for life without parole. When James Holmes appeared in court two weeks ago, his attorney said he was not ready to enter a plea. The judge entered a not guilty plea on his behalf. In this court filing, it's revealed prior to that court appearance, Holmes offered to plead guilty for life in prison without parole. Quote, Mr. Holmes is currently willing to resolve the case to bring the proceedings to a speedy and definite conclusion for all involved. If the prosecution elects not to pursue the death penalty, then it is Mr. Holmes's position that this case could be resolved on April 1st. The defense wants the public and more importantly the victim's families to know that they are very serious about plea bargaining. Legal analyst Dan Reck tells us this plea bargain is similar to Representative Gabby Gifford's case. Shooter Jared Lochner was declared competent to stand trial, then pleaded guilty to avoid a potential death penalty. The only reason a prosecutor wouldn't accept this is if they um, want to execute Mr. Holmes. The next time we're here at the Arapahoe County Courthouse is Monday. That's when the district attorney will determine whether or not he's going to seek the death penalty or whether or not he will accept the plea deal. The DA is obligated to listen to all of the victims' families but does not have to take their advice. Reporting live in Arapahoe County, Marshall Zellinger, 7 News.